Hi, Jolta for Municipal Web TV, and today we are in Berlin with Nike to hang out with Jerome Boateng, who will take us on a tour around some of the most memorable places from his younger days. He grew up here in Berlin, started playing football on the streets, and went on to become a Champions League and World Cup winner. And today our story starts in the backyard of his childhood home, where he kicked the ball for the very first time. What kind of memories do you get when you come back here? Only beautiful memories because I grew up here. It's the flat of my mom. First time I played football was here with my dad, right here. So nothing changed really, so it's a really good memory for me. All right, what yeah. about the sign that you can't play football No, it, it wasn't there when we started playing here. <laughs> so it's new like two years or three years ago. All right. Yeah. Now I'm back on the place where I start to play and now it's great to see like how everything is the same like before, it didn't change anything so yeah it's a great experience. I played most of the time on this ground and this was the beginning and here I learned my skills or yeah I think it was uh, really important that I learn it on the street and not only like the normal training. What would you say was the you know the most important lesson you learn while playing on the streets? Yeah, because it makes you harder, of course. You fall on the ground, you play against older, like real men, and they are stronger, so you have to see how you can play good with them, and that's a good challenge, I think, for a young kid on the street. What about the neighbors? Did you ever get any complaints when you were playing here? Yes, sometimes. When we played like late, or we screamed a lot, or loud, because this house, um, yeah, when the windows open, they hear everything, but it was not a big like, problem. Yo. Can you just quickly tell us, you know, where are we now and what does this place mean yeah. to your career? This is the pitch where I first started training with the Team Tennis Borussia. Um, I had my first game also here and I scored five goals. I played right midfielder and yeah, it's a great experience to come back after years here. Here I grew up and I learned to play football like in a team. Well, what does it mean to you to, you know, be recognized by the by the fans here, <laughs> be a role model for no, the people it's here. Like, yeah, it's, uh, it's crazy for me because I was like them, I was a small kid and I came here, I was excited about training after school and I spent a lot of hours here and now I see the kids there like me, so it's a great feeling. What would you say was the most important lesson you learned here on a, you know, 11 side game? Yeah, like about losing, like I hate to lose and I can remember when I played there and we lost the game, I was completely, I was crying and mad at everything and, and at the other players of my team and yeah, that's a lesson I learned here at this club. Now we are here where um, yeah, I became like a professional player for Hertha BSC Berlin. Amazing. <laughs> I didn't know about this room, so yeah, it's a great, great pictures of the players. I know all of them, so yeah, <laughs> it's funny to see. As we can see in the picture, you're holding the World Cup trophy. Can you please and try and explain to us, you know, how does it feel to win the World Cup? Yeah, <laughs> it's um, difficult to explain. It's pure emotional um, when you hold the cup, especially after the game end and it's still yeah, unbelievable for me and that I'm a part of this team and that I'm a World Cup when I am. So Jerome, where yes. are we right now? Like you can see it's the Olympia Stadium in Berlin. That's the stadium where I get my debut for Hertha BSC Berlin and yeah with 17 years old and that day the dream comes true for me and this is the stadium of the final for the Champions League uh, 2015 so it would be amazing to get to this final. We will see what comes in the future. All right. Thank you, Jerome. Thank you very much. All the much. best yeah. in the future. Thank you Thank very you. much. All right, that's it. So many interviews. Thank you so much. Yeah. Now, we, now we definitely have something. Yeah. <laughs> Just,
Er kommt mit auf Toilette. 